coach Marissa Johnson and today I am excited to bring you an at-home workout for tennis players. The moves that I put in this little workout are actually moves that I'm going to just be doing for myself and I thought I'd share. So me being a tennis player and a coach, I just put together some moves that target tennis specific muscles, a lot of them pretty generic, but if you are one that hasn't worked out in a while, this is a really good, simple way to get back into the groove. I've designed it to where you can do as many sets as you want, but I'm gonna be doing probably three to five, probably, I wanna, I wanna try to get to five, uh, but I might be only doing four in this, um, so you're welcome to follow along with me and do this workout with me. That's why I made it, is so that you can work out with me and I hope you decide to. Um, but before I show you what you're gonna need and what we are doing today, please do not forget to subscribe and like this video. And if you are a huge fan of this and you want more, please tell me in the comments because that lets me know that I need to make more and it's what makes you happy. So, <laughs> without further ado, this is what is going to be in this workout today. Reminder, if you want more because you love, love, love tennis and working out, you have got to get the link in my description of this video for the free seven day footwork challenge. Um, that is a little bit more tennis specific if you were looking for very, very uh, specific to tennis movement and racket type moves, then that is where you want to get that. So please grab your free um, link in the bottom of the description. And that's pretty much all you need to know before we get started. As you saw, you're gonna need one weight and you can use anything you, can, you want for a weight. It doesn't have to be a dumbbell, but we're gonna get started. So here we go. So the first move, of course, just 20 jumping jacks. This is just to get the blood flowing. go down all the way just because I feel like I don't want my arms enough, but um, I'm really bad at push-ups, so I just had to do those simplistically. Next move, you're going to need a weight. I got 15 pounds right here, um, but you can start out with 5 or 10 or however much you need. Um, we've got lateral lunges with the weight and adding the hop, so this gets you a lot of the lateral movement that we do in tennis. And... Yeah, just try to really engage the glutes here. Um, 10 on each side, here we go. So yeah, one, two, Nine, 
Uh, you can take the hop out of that if you need, just so you know. Oh. Whew. Next move, we got 10 squats, weighted squats. So hold your dumbbell up. Okay, here we go. Round two done. Booyah. You're not sweating yet? Uh, try to think about really engaging those certain areas that we're trying to target. On the push ups, it's not just arm strength, it's engaging your lats and your core and a lot of other things. And these lateral ones, really thinking about sitting down and engaging the glutes. And it's a really good hip stretch too. And then the squat, same thing, just like driving through the ground. So if you're not sweating yet, you can do it. Work hard. Okay, round number three. Here we go. Get a little weak there. Oh, push ups. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Go, team. Right on. Let's go. 20.
Jones. Spencer, let's go over here. Alright, ten spots. Let's go.
My bad. Here we go. Ten more. I'm sweating. Mm. I'm starting to shake.